the boys are fighting the boys are fighting love island season eight episode 29 what's up y'all it is jay shanice listen i said oh are they about to get down uh-uh i thought they was real close in this villa but i don't think it is no more but let me tell you something luca and danny are both right they're both right in this argument okay Luca is always being the puppet master acting like the president, okay? Always trying to tell the boys what moves to make, what to do, okay? So I can see that. But I can see Luca's side too telling Danny, like, no, fool, you feel guilty that you kissed that girl Summer. Now you feel guilty about it and you want to take it out on somebody else. But I also, when Danny said, listen, when Danny said, ha, you be holding Jim a hostage, I said, Oh my God, you ain't never lied. But then Luca, who was calling, um, he called, Luca called him a clown, all kinds of stuff. Then Demi was like, shut the fuck, shut the fuck, shut the fuck. I said, oh, y'all about to fight. The boys are fighting. The other guys didn't even know what to do. They're like, well, you know, Luca, you do be being fake, but wait a minute, y'all, we shouldn't be fighting. Wait a minute, what's going on? Where did this come from? I'm like, OMG. Dammy gonna say, you just trying to win the whole thing. That's why you trying to be the puppet master, basically. That's why you trying to be fake. He was like, me and Jimma can leave this thing today. See, but the thing is, he ain't worried about winning Love Islands. He want to win her heart because that's a meal ticket because he is only a fisherman. I don't know how much fishermen make, but they don't make as much as soccer players, okay? That's all I'm saying. I see him seeing Jimma as a come up. That's how I feel. I don't know how other people feel, but I, that's how I feel. And them fighting, baby, I screamed. I hollered. And Luca was still in his feelings when they was going to bed. Like, you calling me fake got under my skin, bro. He was still upset, okay? Luca sat, he slept outside. I said, Luca, where's that extra bed that's in the house? You can sleep in that. Why you gonna sleep outside with the bugs and stuff? Luca don't give a damn. I said, I hope they recover from this. I really do, but Dammy did feel guilty for kissing Summer. He wanted to kiss her, but then after he did it, he felt guilty, and I wanted to put my foot up his ass. That's all I'm saying. Like, oh, you done fucked up the church's money. You fucking around, and I, I hey, don't play with me about India. I, I'm telling you, you ain't no friend of mine if you're going to do India like that. Yes, Summer is cute. Hold on. Did y'all catch when Davide said, Oh, these girls are an upgrade. Almost like India wasn't attractive. Excuse me, Davide. She's a baddie. Shut the fuck up. Okay. I said, what are you, what are you trying to say? And I did like that. Dammy was like, hold on, hold on. India is pretty too. And I'm like, yes. What are you on, Davide? Don't get slapped the fuck out of. Please don't. Oh, Lord. Mm. I, you listen. That lit okay. I'm gonna move on for that stuff because I will fall off the mountain down the cliff, down to the river and the lake, whatever, the ocean. Because, listen, I didn't like that comment one goddamn bit. What are you trying to say? I'm going to move on, okay? Anyways, India and Digi, is it DG? Because somebody said DG. I was like, I, that what, is that right? Whatever, that's how we going to say it. He asked about the kiss because in the challenge they kissed and all that. He's, um, she said he looks good. She, he's a good looking guy. She's open to exploring and she's just being true to herself. She wants to explore her options. Her and Dammy both said the same thing. Like basically if I was messing with him on the outside, I would still be dating other people until we made it official. I'm like, that's true. But DG is really cute. He is really handsome. I mean, he's easy on the eyes. I'm just saying. Shout out to Coco. Coco is making moves. She kissing Andrew. She kissing Davide. I said, this girl is popular, okay? I'm not even mad at her because if you want to get picked, you got to make moves. Do y'all think Andrew is going to pick her? Her and Andrew kiss. They sharing a bed. They was making out in the bed. Um, he said he is not playing with Tasha. Tasha got him out here looking like a mug. He is taking his power back, baby, okay? Andrew straight up told Coco, hey, you're my type. And 
they kissed and all that. I am so happy for Andrew just because he does need to be making power moves because Tasha been talking and like playing him like a puppet master too. I said, okay, but listen, I'm not mad at Coco for making all these moves. Her and Davide also talked. They did they kiss? They kissed. They kissed underwater in the challenge. And he can't see himself getting serious with Ekisu. Do y'all believe that or not? Because I do feel like I don't see it for him in Ekisu. Um, he said that she's good looking. She said she's Italian. She's Italian, but she can't speak Italian. You know, I don't know what's going on with that. But maybe Davide can teach her some things. You get what I'm saying? He can teach her a few words. But with Davide, I think Davide is checking more for Molly, even though... Did, who said they was second choice? Did Molly say he was her second choice? I think that's what Molly said. Oh, he was her second choice because she thought he was married off with Ekinsu. But you know that ain't true. He is single and he is ready to mingle. So him and Molly shared a bed and they was kissing and making out. So we gonna see if that's what it is. Because she said, Molly said he caught her eye. So we just got to see what's going on with that, okay? Then Danica, our girl Danica, our good sis Danica, okay? Her and Josh, the Fresh Prince, is talking. They kissing. They going to share a bed. We going to see what happens because they was making out in that bed. I said, yes, Danica. Yes, honey. You need this. You've been here too long playing with these fools, okay? So I think he's got a good chance of coming to the villa as long as no other guy gets in his way, okay? Then, I'm trying to think. Oh, India done found Dammy's ring, y'all. India found his ring. I forgot to say that. Yeah, she found his ring. I said, didn't he put his ring in there? She found it. I'm like, thank God, girl. You weren't looking hard enough. That's like me looking for my keys when I lose them. Be like, nope, I guess I ain't going to work today. Y'all pray for me because I can't find my car keys. And they be right in front of my face. Good sis found it. She found it. I'm still holding out hope for them. I really am, y'all. I know y'all probably think I'm crazy, but I'm holding out for India and them. Let's talk about Jay in China. Look at Jay. Jay in China. I'm liking this. I'm really like, he talked to her. He had a few chats with her within the day. I said, I know that's right. He said he doesn't have a type. She wants a tall man that can pick her up. I said, okay, girl, don't we all put me up on the kitchen counter, honey. And he got all that body, oddy, oddy. He's tall. He can do that. He said he is excited. He likes talking to her. He is trying to get to know only her. He ain't really with the other girls that then came. She wanted to kiss him. Did they kiss? I don't know if they kissed. He likes China the most and they sleeping in the bed together. I said, okay. I think China will be coming back, staying in the villa. So I am happy about that. The rest of them is up in the air. I don't know what we going to do, but you know, Friday, they're going to leave us on a cliffhanger. And Sunday is probably when they come back and recouple and we're going to see who picked who, right? Because how long is Castle Moore? Castle Moore is not that long, like maybe a few days. So we're going to see. We are going to see. Ekin Sue and George had a good conversation. It, she is, you know, just like all for Davide. But I'm like, baby, I don't know if you should be doing that, Ekisu. I done told your crazy ass not to trust Davide, but you just don't want to listen to me, okay? And she asked him, do he want to get married and have kids eventually? He said, yeah, eventually, but you never can. You can never plan that. And But she said her heart and her mind is with Davide. And I'm like, girl... You're going to be so heartbroken. We're going to have to hold you and wipe your tears away and stuff because Davide is playing. I don't know. I'm on the fence. I feel like Davide might stay with Ekisu just because if he's after the money, he will. But they won't last outside the villa. But if he is not after the money, then he might come back with another girl. And that would leave Ekisu single okay they got to play the that game raunchy race which i always enjoy that challenge people was kissing everybody everybody was kissing sucking toes kissing in the water kissing i don't know tall to short birthdays in december it was just a whole lot going on a whole lot a lot a lot going on <laughs> anyways the girls end up winning castle moore was kicking and taking names okay luca got real competitive i said uh-uh not the president and the puppet master getting competitive but i really think that was it y'all i really do tasha and billy talked but you know i don't care about tasha 
she's coming out of her shell. He works construction. And she said he's lovely to talk to and chit chat and have some good laughs. I'm trying to think of anybody else, but I think that's it. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. I will see y'all tomorrow. Have a good night, good morning, good afternoon. And if you're in America, happy fucking 4th of July. But are we supposed to be celebrating that? I don't know, but I'm sure about to go eat some barbecue. That's just period. Bye.